everybody, it's Amy. I'm here again. Um, so thanks for tuning in. Um, I'm just going to warn you right off the bat. If you do not want to hear any of the spoilers about any of the new releases that are coming for the fall catalog, the harvest collection, the holiday collection, or any of like Disney limited time collections that are going to be popping up between now and December, then this is not the video for you. So definitely tune out if you're not a spoilers person. But if you are, which I'm hoping you are because I am, I am going to give it all to you guys. I'm going to show you everything that I've at least been shown. Um, there is going to be a lot more details once the collections do become closer to like their launch date in regards to like pricing and some of the scent descriptions I don't have for some fragrances and like launch dates and things like that. But they have confirmed that these items are going to be available between August and December basically. Okay. So I have um, kind of put together a little PowerPoint presentation. Um, there was tons and tons and tons of screenshots that people were sharing because Scentsy Family Reunion just end ended, which is like their big convention. So they do get a whole bunch of like different spoiler alerts and swag and all kinds of other stuff. So, all right. So as we all know, as of September 1st, the fall and winter catalog will drop. Um, the fall and winter catalog will run from September 1st to February 28th, my birthday, holla, yes. Um, so anything that's in the catalog, you can purchase between September 1st and February 28th um, while supplies last. Usually if it's a catalog item, they will restock it if it becomes like out of stock, like a scent circle or a wax bar or whatever. Limited collections are different though, but anything that's catalog, they'll usually restock it. So as we know, every catalog season, they always create 10 new fragrances to feature. Um, so this season is no different. Um, we do have 10 new releases. Um, they are Cranberry and Cardamom, which is Bold Cherry, White Cranberry and Warm Cardamom, Dashing, which is Vanilla, Mahogany and Night Skies, Fall Feeling, which is Blood Orange, Sugared Cranberry, Juniper and Clove, Frosted Cedar, which is Red Delicious Apple, White Cedar Vanilla, Frosty Air, which is going to be a Sweet Citrus, Lily of the Valley, and Frosty Air, Golden Garland, which is going to have Pine Needles, Marigold Petals, Orange Twist, and Golden Musk, Make Me Snickerdoodle, which is the one bakery that we're getting, <laughs> um, at least one new bakery, uh, Cookie Dough, Brown Sugar, Vanilla Bean, and Sugared Cinnamon, Midnight Mahogany is Black Plum, Cinnamon, and Mahogany, Palo Santo and Cinnamon is Palo Santo, Italian Bergamot, Clove Leaf, and Cinnamon Bark, and Red Currant Reef is Red Currant, Winterberries, Evergreen, and Sandalwood. So these 10 new releases will be in the catalog for fall. You can get them in Wax Bar, Room Spray, and Scent Circle. Um, they won't be available in, in any other products, but they will be available in those three. And you can club them. You can throw them in a bundle and save. You can buy them individually. All between, you know, the catalog from the September 1st to February 28th. So according to the catalog, these are the scents that are returning to the fall and winter catalog. So besides the 10 new ones, these are the ones that are returning. So we've got aloe water and cucumber, Amazon rain, apple and cinnamon sticks, apple cherry strudel, Arctic kiss, around the campfire, autumn hearth, autumn road trip, Autumn Sunset, Baked Apple Pie, Black Currant and Plum, Black Raspberry Vanilla, Blue Grotto, Blueberry Cheesecake by the Sea, Caramel Apple Craze, Cashmere and Corduroy, Cedar Cider, Christmas Cottage, Cider Mill, Cinnamon Bear, Cinnamon Vanilla, Clean Breeze Clothesline, Clove and Cinnamon, Cozy Cardigan, Crown Apple Crumble, Eucalyptus Reef, Falling Apples, Farm Stand Pumpkin, First Day of Fall, Fluffy Fleece, French Lavender, Frosted Vanilla, Huckleberry Hideaway, Jammy Time, Johnny Appleseed, Just Breathe, Lemon Drizzle Cake, Luna, Maple Apple Bourbon, Mocha Doodle, Mystery Man, Newborn Nursery, Perfect Day, Perfect Peppermint, Polar Bear Hug, Pumpkin Cinnamon Swirl, Pumpkin Roll, Salted Caramel Toffee, Scarlet Sunflower, Scary Good, 
Silver Bells, Sips of Cider, Squeeze the Day, Sunkissed Citrus, Vanilla Bean Buttercream, Velvet Moon, Very Snowy Spruce, Weathered Leather, Welcome Home, White Amber and Silk, White Amber and Teak, and Winterberry Apple Tea. So those will be all the fragrances that will be returning to the Fall and Winter Catalog where you can purchase them in their selected products, um, whether it's the uh, wax bars, the circles, the scent packs, the room sprays, the pods. Um, once I actually get my catalog in, I will do a video and I'll go through um, each page with you guys um, just to do like a catalog, you know, walk through. Um, I'm not sure which ones are available in pod form yet, but I'll know soon. So what does this mean? Well, there are some new scents that we have already previously seen um, from like last year's limited time collections or scents of the month, and they are returning to catalog. So they decided to bring candy cane buttercream, cinnamon pine cones, and give me candy to the catalog. And they actually brought back a old retired scent of snowberry and put it back in the catalog. So we've got three limited time scents that they are now making them a returning main product. And then they brought a, a scent out of the vault and put it in the catalog. So that's pretty cool. So what does this mean? Well, it means that they did retire some to make room for all these scents. Unfortunately, that means they retired Be Merry, Berry Blessed, Blue Sage and Tonka, Bright Cider Life, Cinnamon Buttercream, uh, Clementine Cupcake, Dancing Sugar Plums, Fairy Tale Pumpkin, Graham Cracker Crunch, Harvest Blessings, Hug in a Mug, Ice Pine, Icicles and Evergreen, Orchard Apple and Spice, Pomegranate Prosecco, Pumpkin Chai, Spiced Ember Glow, Sugar Cookie, Tinselberry, Toasted Acorn and Oak, Vanilla Cinnamon Maple, and Very Merry Cranberry. So those 22 fragrances are no longer available. We cannot purchase them in main catalog. The only way to get these bars again is hopefully you either club them, you stocked up on them really good, or we can just cross our fingers that they're in the next clearance or flash sale um, upgrade and we can get them there. So there are other products that are leaving the catalog as of tomorrow. Um, so I did make a note that Coastal Sunset is not carrying over in the cleaning line. So you will not be able to buy Coastal Sunset after August 31st in bathroom cleaner, counter clean, or the all-purpose concentrate. As well as I noticed that Coconut Daiquiri is not carrying over to the body care line next catalog. So next month, August, will be the last time you can purchase Coconut Daiquiri in hand soap, hand cream, body wash, or the body cream. All right, so as with the 10 new fragrances that Scentsy creates each catalog, they also create new warmers. Um, so, so these are some of the new warmers. You guys, holy shit, they are beautiful. I'm going to go broke as hell between the new warmers and the Harvest Collection. I'm telling you right now, I need to start saving. I need to start a yard sale. I don't know what I'm going to do. Um, so Forest Light, we can see her on the left. It's a gorgeous, it looks like it's going to be a tin. It's very similar to that Northern Winter Nights warmer that we had for the scent of the month. The Golden Meadow is what I want. This is like a gold foliage. It's absolutely beautiful. It's going to be ceramic, so it's going to glow all the time when it's on. It is just perfect for that minimalist, just simplistic, natural decor. I, I want that warmer, like now. Um, we've got some new mini warmers. So we've got an iridescent cactus. It's going to be called Sedona on the left. It's got the little nubs um, that make it a cactus. Um, looks like it's really going to be pretty. And then we've got emerald waves, which is just a nice ombre type of um, ceramic warmer. And then these ones on the left, they're calling them the mod warmers. It looks like they're going to be element warmers, very similar to the Simply Diamond and the Simply Slate that we just recently have. They're just a very mini, like, version of an element warmer. But these are more, like, 60s is what I'm calling it with the mod colors. So they're, it's going to be in taupe, sage, and black. And then on the right, people are going to go ape shit over this mallard duck warmer. I, I, I didn't think... 
the Flamingo was going to sell well. I mean, there are people that do like Flamingos. So the Flamingo Warmer that we have in our current catalog right now is still available. But this Mallard Duck, I do not expect this <laughs> to last long or they're going to have to restock it. But it's cute as hell. If I liked birds enough, I'd probably buy this one too. Um, the Mini Warmer is gorgeous too. It's black and then it's glowing through those pussy willows at the bottom. So that is really gorgeous. And these are um, on the left. That's this called a verve warmer. It's kind of like a psychedelic um, glass warmer. They said that it's made out of uh, recycled glass. So it's pretty neat. And then on the right is the charitable cause warmer that they're doing this catalog. It's for like the Heart Association. Um, so it is a white ceramic and it's got like those little dots. Kind of like almost similar to the Aziza warmer that we have now. Um, so that's really good. Okay, new products that are launching. So we are now going to have tabletop fan diffusers. So as you know, we already have the Sensi Go, which is a fan diffuser system that you can use the pods instead of wax. We have the plug-in fan diffusers, and then we have the mini fan diffusers that can go in your car. And then obviously the air purifier. Well, now we're going to have these tabletop ones that are rechargeable. So they don't have to be left plug in. You just charge them and then you can leave them out on your dining room table, your mantle, your buffet table, wherever you want to put them. And it's just a really nice way to, to use it as a decor piece, but then also, you know, fragrance your house. So it's going to be available in like a speckled um, color and then the, this woven pattern that you see on the right. So with the catalog changeover, we do have some new scents in other products. Um, so we have the cleaning line is going to be Scarlet Sunflower. The body care line, we're going to have Glacier Water. And in laundry, we're going to have White Amber Antique. And they have extended the Scentsy Fresh, um, giving us it, it as an option in um, Fluffy Fleece and Fiji Flower. So that's pretty cool. There's also some new products for the kids. So we've got a new Boston Terrier buddy and then some new buddy clips in a T-Rex and a Leopard. All right, you guys, here's the Harvest Collection. This shit's dropping September 1st as well. Whoops. I don't know what happened. Okay, there we go. Um, this is dropping September 1st along with the launch of the Fall and Winter Catalog. Um, so be prepared. And like I said, I put a disclaimer on this slide because I said, due to popularity, items may sell out. So if you want any of these Harvest Collections, please message me, contact me in any way, email, Facebook message, comment under this video. I will get a hold of you and we'll get you added to my pre-order list because I'm telling you, things are going to sell out. They're that gorgeous that I anticipate things selling out. So we do have the um, five new Harvest fragrances. Um, so we're going to have White Pumpkin and Driftwood, which is White Pumpkin, Driftwood, White Cardamom, and Solar Amber. Forever Fall, which is Baked Pumpkin, Cinnamon Sticks, and Brown Sugar. Fall into Love, which is Orange Peel, Cool Eucalyptus, and Sweet Balsam. Dutch Apple Bread, which is Sliced Apples, Warm Cinnamon, Rolled Oats, Brown Sugar. And Cashmere Leaves, which is Apples, Falling Leaves, and Cashmere Spice. Um, so these can be available for individual purchase, or they're going to have a five-pack bundle where you get this really cool little gift bag that they go in. Um, so as... Like I said, we're having a new tabletop fan diffuser as a new product line. So we are going to get a jack-o'-lantern one for the Harvest Collection. And then here's another picture of it. And then they're going to have pod packs in the Forever Fall, Fall into Love, and Cashmere and Leaves available to purchase. We have a new flower option in the fragrance flowers for the Harvest Collection. We're going to be having a stunning sunflower. And the scents available are Forever Fall. Fall into Love and Cashmere Leaves. And as you can see, the oil is colored. So when that oil does soak into the paper flower, it does turn that paper flower to a different color. These are some of the returning Harvest Warmers from last year's Harvest Collection. So the Calavera uh, Mini, the Fall Fairy Tale Pumpkin, which you guys have seen in my picks because I got that one last year, and the Luminous Leaves Mini. 
These are some of the new ones though. This white truck, this is going to sell out instantly. I'm telling you right now, it's going to sell out. It's going to sell out. Um, it's going to come with a pumpkin delivery lid. And then, whoops, and then this one is a Witcher Lantern. Whoops. Hold on, I just got to scroll down here. Okay, so then we got a new, we have two new minis. So we've got Spooky Stare, which is a black cat. We've got the Chillin' Brew, which is a little witch's cauldron that says trick or treat. And it's got the little skeleton sitting in it, soaking up the wax. I absolutely love that one. I'm going to get that one. And then this is an element one. It's a wicker white pumpkin, wicker basket white pumpkin. Absolutely gorgeous. I want that one too. And then these are some of the other new ones. So we're getting a larger full-size warmer of that Calaverita um, skull head. We're going to get a fall fairy tale mini um, warmer. And then a full-size Let's Get Batty. Fall into Love will be featured in the Laundry Products and Scentsy Fresh. And returning Autumn Road Trip will be available in Dish Soap, you guys. They brought back Dish Soap for a limited time. And then Counter Clean. Um, obviously, there's always oils for those that diffuse with oils instead of the wax. Um, so they've got three ha uh, Harvest Scents, Snake Oil and Cedarwood, Wolf's Bane and Apple Brandy and Beetles and Blood Orange. And then there will be a three-pack hand soap in Fall Into Love, Autumn Road Trip, and Velvet Moon. A new buddy clip, Batista the Bat. And this is a new product launch. This is actually one of those fabric pumpkin pillows and it holds two scent packs so it's just a really cute decor piece and those fabric pumpkins are super super popular with decor right now so that's pretty cool and then obviously disney's got to put their two cents in here so they made a mickey mouse jack-o-lantern warmer and it does come with a special fragrance um it's called disney's frightfully delightful it's golden pumpkin harvest peach whipped vanilla and brown sugar they also will have, um, I don't know the date yet, it's somewhere in mid-September, they're going to drop a limited collection. They're going to take three fall favorite warmers out of the vault and bring them back for a limited time. So we have Tom the Turkey. I have been looking for this one for years, years, you guys. I love this Tom the Turkey one. Um, this is a Fright Nights mini and then Scarecrow um, warmer. That's a really old one. Oh, I also wanted to mention that in the catalog, they are featuring bricks. So there will actually be bricks available all catalog long to purchase on their own. It's just in three cents though. Um, so it's only going to be in Christmas Cottage Pumpkin Roll and Very Snowy Spruce. But they will be available in the catalog. So you don't have to have a club to get a brick now. So this is really good. I'm hoping that this means that they're going to do this more and continue allowing us to have other bricks to purchase besides the ones in club and besides like the holiday ones that they always do, which leads me into the holiday bricks. Um, so we are going to have a five holiday brick sometime in November. I think, um, the five, there's four new fragrances and one returning. So the four new are Holly Jolly Cider, Orange Spice and Everything Nice, Candy Apple, and Forever Flannel. And then the new one that's returning from the Cozy Collection is Cozy Kitchen. We are going to have a sense of the season this year again. Um, so, sen whoops, sense of the season. If I can get back to my slide. Oh, my God, I hate PowerPoint. <laughs> um, sense of the season. There's two returning fragrances and three brand new. So, the returning are Homestead Holiday. Hallelujah. So happy about that. Uh, Peppermint Rush. And then the three new ones are Caramel Praline Cake, Frosted Winter Pine, and Sugar Plum Berry. This is the, um, on the here on the right, this is going to be the limited time holiday collectors warmer that they create. It's actually interactive. The, the entire snowman body is a snow globe, and it does actually whip up the snow and it's super, super pretty. I'll have to find the video if I can find it and share it. 
And then the Sunspirations, they are continuing that again. So we did see that last fall and winter where they did vanilla um, bean buttercream. And then this spring and summer, they did like Go Go Mango. Um, this fall and winter, they are going to do Christmas Cottage. Um, so they're going to have Christmas Cottage, Christmas Cottage Mint, Christmas Cottage Reef, and Christmas Cottage Cider. Also, when the holiday collection drops, there's going to be five new fragrances that they created. I don't have the scent descriptions yet, but the names of them are Cherries Jubilee, Vanilla Barnwood, Sleigh Ride, Cranberry Candy Cane, and Rum Pum Plum. These are some of the new holiday warmers for the holiday collection. We've got a big snowman, a mini snowman, a reindeer, a very old wooden Santa Claus, um, this snowflake mini warmer. We've also got this huge gingerbread house, another um, mini warmer that says merry and bright with snowflakes. The Christmas camper is actually going to be available in a mini warmer. And any of these mini warmers, you can buy the tabletop base that, that you can buy separately for 15 bucks and make it a small, like full size warmer. And then this snow um, one right here. I really like that one. That's cute. Okay. Oh, I get to the next one. All right. So these are the new holiday collection products. Um, so they are going to do a tabletop fan diffuser in the gingerbread man option for the holiday collection. And there is a new buddy. She's going to be called Gretchen the gingerbread bear. I think people are really going to want that one. And then for the holiday collection, they are going to pull three old favorites from the vault. Um, so we've got the Santa Claus belt warmer, the Red Cardinals coming back, and then Heavenly. Um, they're also, I didn't have a picture of it, um, but they are bringing back the white retro truck with the Christmas tree delivery lid. Um, so I'm hoping that means if the pumpkin one sells out, that we'll be able to have a second chance to purchase it with the holiday one. But I'll know more once um, that collection gets closer to its launch time and they, you know, give me all the details. We're having a holiday at Hogwarts collection, you guys. Harry Potter for Christmas. So we have a Harry Potter Scentsy Buddy. So stinking cute. Um, we're going to have four different mini warmers for each of the Hogwarts um, houses. So Gryffindor, Slytherin, Hufflepuff, and Ravenclaw. All the Harry Potter scents are back too. And then on the right is Hogwarts at Christmas. So it's the whole Hogwarts castle, but it's all white ceramic. Freaking gorgeous. That is definitely going to sell. And then it wouldn't be Christmas without Disney. So we've got two new Disney collections. Um, two, one's a buddy. So we're going to have Stitch with a Santa hat. You can't really see the Santa hat in this picture, um, but he has one on his head and then he's got one sticking out of his mouth. And then we do have a new Mickey and Minnie sleigh warmer. And then that fragrance, um, I think it's called Disney Seasons of Magic. That will be coming with that Minnie and Mickey uh, warmer. Dumbo's coming back, you guys. So they are going to go ahead and relaunch Dumbo. Um, it is going to be relaunched. So the buddy is going to come back. And the old fragrance, uh, Dumbo Circus, that is returning. But this new warmer, it's interactive. It actually spins. Um, when I am able to get a video of it actually doing it, I'll share it. And then this new scent, Soar High Through the Sky, it is going to be available in a brick. And they said, they didn't give us a scent description, but they said that it was carnival related. So they said, think things like churro dough, cotton candy, and popcorn. So I don't know what it's going to be, but when I know more details, I'll definitely share it with you guys. The villains collection is returning. So ecstatic about it. Um, so they are going to do a new warmer, which we see here on the left. It's a poison apple. And then in the eyes, you can actually see an interactive like movie scenes from Snow White, like the witch and all that. And then the three scents, which was Ursula's scent, Maleficent scent, and then the, the Snow Queen. Um, those all three are coming back, but they're also going to be available in fragrance flowers. And the fragrance flower option is called Wilted Rose. So as you can see right here, it's just 
the epitome of goth. Like, it looks so awesome. And then we're going to have our Ursula buddy, which is awesome. I need to get that Ursula buddy because we already have Ariel and Sebastian. And if I get Ursula, then the only thing I need to complete my Little Mermaid collection is Flounder. So... Monsters Inc. They are releasing Monsters Inc. back. Um, they are gonna. It's a huge collection. So we've got the full size buddies of so, uh, what's his name? Sully. Yes, yeah, Sully and Mike. And then we have a uh, Mike mini warmer, and then a full size Sully warmer where he's busting it out of Boo's room. And then there is a fragrance too. I think it's called Montropolis. That's coming back. In October, they are going to do a breast cancer collection. Um, so we're going to have this warmer right here to the right. It's got all those different pinholes. It is pink. There's four new fragrances that they came out with it. I think it has like pink in the name. It's like Think Positively or I don't know. I can't remember what the names are. But once we get sent descriptions, I'll definitely um, let you guys know. It looks like they're going to be available in Scent Circle. And there's a fragrance flower and a leopard, snow leopard buddy. Holy frig, you guys. So I literally jumped out of my seat when I saw this. They have friends. And I think the only reason why they have friends is because Disney bought out Warner Brothers. And I'm pretty sure Warner Brothers made friends, the sitcom show. So we have a friends couch element warmer coming. Holy moly. It's actually coming next month. It's going to be launched August 7th. I'm going to put a separate post um, to let you guys know about all the details on that. Um, that is going to sell. I know it's going to sell. Um, and, it's, and it does have a new wax bar to go with it, which it looks like it's going to be a coffee one because they said it had fresh coffee and espresso and coconut cream. And then later this fall, we're going to have Willy Wonka. So no warmer, nothing like that. No buddies. I was hoping we would get like a Oompa Loompa buddy, but um, it's just the three bars. So fizzy lifting drinks, violets turning violet, and everlasting gobstopper. And that is it, you guys. So that is what I have been told on what's coming between now and December. Um, like I said, there's probably other things in the collections um, that we haven't um, been told. Like I said, some of the dates I don't really know yet. Some of the pricing I don't know yet. Some of the scent descriptions. So as things come and get closer to the dates, I'll definitely um, let you guys know as always in the VIP group. But I wanted you guys to see what I saw so you could prepare, ugh, prepare yourselves, save those pennies. Because I'm telling you, I'm going to go broke as hell. Because there's so much in that harvest collection I want. But um, I hope you guys like this video. I couldn't do like a live to interact with you guys. Just because the kids are driving me nuts this weekend. So I just figured I'd just record this um, video. And then just post it. So that way you guys can watch it at your leisure. Take screenshots. Um, what have you. So as always if you have any questions. Please 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 just comment below the video. And if you want any of these items and you want me to put you on a pre-order list please get a hold of me so that way i can do so for you all right so thanks always for the support and hope you guys are having a great weekend and enjoying the weather and i will see you soon bye